aka Intellect and Heels and welcome back to my channel. Today is all about love. It's all about Valentine's Day and I have put some outfits together or put some looks together that I think you will enjoy as inspiration if you're going out for like a Valentine's Day or you have you know you and your boo going out for dinner or whatever you're going to do I have some outfit inspiration for you you to all of my oldies but goodies thanks for coming back to see me and and for all of my newbies if you like fashion faith beauty and lifestyle then i guarantee you will enjoy this channel go ahead and hit that subscribe button and turn on your notifications so you never miss when i upload i usually upload on fridays at 8 a.m eastern time so there you go now on to these Valentine's Day looks. I know y'all are going to enjoy them. Okay, ladies, these Valentine's Day looks are a little different from the norm because I'm not really a red girl. I did do my lips in red in honor of Valentine's Day, but I really don't have anything red. The more, the most red I had like a long time ago was shoes, but I don't buy a lot of red. And I don't know why it's just not a color that I gravitate toward. So for all of you girls who don't really gravitate toward red or a whole lot of like pink and want something to wear on Valentine's Day that feels more you, well, I have a treat for you because I have these outfits that are going to definitely give you the inspiration you need if you know need a little pick me up. It's almost Valentine's Day. We're almost there a couple of days away and you need some out outfit inspo. Here we go. This is for you. Okay, the first outfit that I have is, or the first look that I have, because it's not really an outfit, it's more of a look, um, is this dress that if you follow me, you know that I love Amazon The Drop, and I got this dress from one of the Amazon The Drops. This is Lucy's Whims. She's an influencer that did a drop, uh, I think, around summertime last year, and this little black dress, I love it. I love it because it has a little... It's like a tank top on the top and then it has a cutout in the middle and if you're in a cold weather climate of course you can wear a trench coat or something like really cute and fluffy over it faux fur or something like that if you choose if you're in a cold weather climate and it will pop off it will be so cute so if you look if you have a little black dress or some number like that it will definitely look cute and you can also if you have a shoe that is a pop of color of course because this is black you can wear that pop of color shoe i chose something kind of simple and frilly so i chose this because it was more of i was going for more of a, like a sexy you know just a sexy cool look so this is my sexy cool look and these shoes i've had forever these are bcbg generation and yeah old shoes but still did the job and I love the material because they're like the velvety material so it's perfect for this season so yeah but like I said if you're in a cold I'm in the warm weather so I don't necessarily need like a big jacket or anything over something that I'm wearing with no sleeves but if you do trench coat or a faux fur or something like that will do this outfit justice but I love this dress I love how the look came together and I just judged it up with the top on and yeah girl and i love also this material is super thick so you don't have to worry about being like cold if you need to wear tights wear tights but it is super thick so i think even if you were in a cold weather you would actually be kind of comfortable okay on to look number two absolutely love this little mini dress this is for all of my like cute flirty girls who love a little short dress this dress from zara i picked it up i believe toward the fall of last year if you watch me on instagram if you watch me here you would know you would have definitely seen this dress before um this month i'm really just shopping my closet and showing you girls that you can actually wear your stuff and it make it look new and not break the bank so girl look look in your closet it's something in there for you anywho yes this dress i love it is basically sheer at the top but it has all these these flower of course it's floral so then you can't really see right through it but it is sheer at the top and it has like a slip at the bottom and it has like this frill detail here and it has a belt that go around that goes around it which i think is super cute so yes i love this dress and i paired it with these steve 
Madden. Um, they had to dupe other Versace um, platforms, but girl, platforms are still in. We're still in, we're still doing our platforms, and this pink is just giving life. So, like I said, if I have any flashy colors, it's going to be in my shoes more than anything. But yeah, these pink shoes are giving life. I don't know if they're still on sale, Steve Madden. I can check, but yeah, I love these, and I love the look together. It's fun. It's it's fun, it's flirty, it's cute, and yeah, it's perfect for the Valentine's Day quote-unquote holiday. I don't know if it's a holiday because we don't really get off from work, but it's a special day. So for the Valentine's Day holiday or whatever you want to call it, cute and flirty, if, the, if you're the girly girl and super feminine, I think that outfit would be just for you, okay? And then we are off to outfit number three. Well, not six three <laughs> okay the next outfit um is for all of my cool sexy sleek neutral girls yes this is this outfit i just wanted to give something for all the girls who are not like super feminine but have that that pair of like masculine and feminine look i love this outfit i got this crochet skirt from h&m last spring actually um I love it. It's super cute. I really haven't had a chance to wear it all that much, but this year I'm getting my wear out of this. I definitely am. And it's super cute. Of course it is see-through, but the way that I have the jacket sitting, you don't have to worry about anything showing. And of course this is the oversized jacket that I absolutely adore that I got from Amazon. I'm looking into actually getting a white one because I love it so much. So when you see the white one, don't say nothing. Just, just go with it. Just go with it. But yes, I love this jacket it gives me so much life every time i put it on i can pair it with almost anything and it's a look it's a look and then as far as the shoes i paired it with these old bcbg um cheetah print heels that i've had forever i don't even know when i got these shoes but i had them forever and i love them but that's just like these um, you can also do, just do a pop, pop of color and it'll set the outfit off as well. So this is another outfit where if you need that little extra oomph of color um, to feel like it's Valentine's Day, that extra oomph of red or something like that, then this is the perfect outfit to do that with. But I just paired it with this pop of animal print and I love it. So yeah, and then we're on to the final outfit, last but not least, the final look look number four and the final look that i have look number four is this outfit that i have on um it is this amazon the drop shirt that i just got recently this year and these sparkly pants that i got i don't know if you see these these sparkly pants from express like four or five years ago and I don't often get a chance to wear them all the time but when I do I love it and for all of my girls who just need you know it might be Valentine's Day or need a little pick-me-up and you want a little sparkle I'm sure Express still has these pants somewhere in the arsenal or you have some type of pants with some sheen to it or something like that it will set it off but I love this outfit and of course again this is an outfit that you can you know create a pop of color with I did that with these shoes that I got from Drake Closet these Rebecca Minkoffs like just adding a little spruce a little um pop of color I love this shoe because it's velvet which is perfect for the season I mean suede it has a suede look which is perfect for the season so I love that but if you have red or any cute little pop of color this outfit will be perfect for that as well but I love the shine if you just need to sparkle a little bit to make yourself feel better or you just one of those sparkle girls who love sparkle this is the perfect outfit for you I played down the top because of course you didn't want too much sparkle but I played down the top and then the pants are sparkling and then the shoes of course that pop of color that I love just to let you guys know I didn't accessorize these outfits a lot because I wanted you to get the inspiration take what you could from them and then make it your own um, I don't want anyone to be a carbon copy of me these are just ideas and, and looks and inspiration for you to take with you and then add some of the ideas to your own wardrobe or to your own looks so that's why sometimes I don't over accessorize I don't show the purse or the jewelry I'm not really a jewelry girl so I pretty much keep it simple but I don't sometimes go all out because this is inspo this is 
something that I use to help you in your your own search for your own look or your own search for your own style so that's a little caveat so uh, sometimes I don't sometimes I do will accessorize the look up but other times I'll keep it simple just so you can go ahead and do what you want to do with the look it's up to you Anywho, that is all of my Valentine's Day inspiration for you. So if you're a last minute girl and you got some things you're trying to put together and you can't seem to figure out what you want to wear, I'm here to help. So anywho, I hope this inspired you. I hope this helped you out in your search for excuse me, in your search for your own style and your search for your own looks that you can put together. Go in your closet. I'm sure you will find something great there. Light, love, and blessings, y'all. Peace out.